challenges of getting goods to the market by freight are to be examined by two committees. The Economy, Energy and Tourism Committee will examine the current barriers for exporting, while the Infrastructure Committee is looking into freight transport issues. Exporting is crucial to the future success of the Scottish economy. The Scottish Government has a, a target to increase the volume of exports by 50% by 2017, and on, on current indications we're not close uh, to meeting that. So we want to try and learn what we can do to assist uh, Scottish businesses who want to grow their exports and how that can, can contribute to the future success of the Scottish economy. In 2012, only 17% of the international exports were from small companies and the top three were from the larger food and drink industry and the business services. Well, we're asking the freight transport industry, be it air, rail, um, sea or road, what the consider to be the barriers facing uh, their industry, what we can do to improve connectivity, what we can do to make sure the infrastructure is as good as it can be, but overall to make sure that the freight transport industry is able to operate effectively so that we can export uh, our goods uh, across the world and so that we can um, and continue to be a successful trading nation. The committee wants to hear from you. The Infrastructure Committee asks... What are the main infrastructure and policy obstacles to the free flow of freight in Scotland? How can Scotland's freight routes to UK, Europe and worldwide be improved? What improvements are required to increase the flow of goods through Scotland's seaports? The Economy Committee would like to hear your views too. What experiences and challenges are faced by exporters? Why do some firms, particularly SMEs, not export? How effective are SDI, UKTI, Scottish Enterprise and Highland and Island Enterprise? Will the Scottish Government meet its target of increasing the value of exports by 50% by 2017? There, there are a whole range of issues where businesses, I think, are concerned. Maybe they're not getting the help that they need when they want to export. And of course, we also want to hear examples of good practice and success stories, of which there are very many. You can contact us by email, telephone or on the committee's Twitter pages. They look forward to hearing from you.